He captured the city like no one else. Rob Edouaneau's photographs of Paris have become French icons. Now a new exhibition brings together his studies of one of Paris's most significant areas, Les Halles. This was once Paris's central market and a hub of life and activity before it was controversially knocked down in the 1970s. Luckily, Duano was there to capture a world that would soon be lost forever. They have amazing, great faces, these butchers, these tough old guys, and you can really get the feeling that my father loved photographing them. You can see there was some sympathy. The glances are glances of complicity. He liked them, that's obvious, and he knew them. The works on show capture a multitude of trades and professions that used to be practiced here in what was known as the belly of Paris. For his daughters, who are curating the exhibition, the key to Duano is that he always saw things partly as a suburban boy overwhelmed by the big city. The noise, the chaos and the colour. He really, really liked colour, although he liked to be provocative. At the end of his life, he used to say if he had to do it all over again, he'd do everything in colour. In 1971, the markets were judged a health risk and summarily demolished. The area has struggled with slow-moving or abortive building projects ever since and never regained its former liveliness. He wasn't a man of nostalgia who dwelt in the past. He never thought things were better in the old days, but this was simply something he saw as being monumentally stupid. <laughs> The loss of the markets at Leal is something many Parisians still can't understand. The latest project designed to occupy the site is due in 2016 and briefly outlined at the end of this exhibition. But whatever its qualities, it's unlikely to match the colour and activity of the markets, reserved on film by one of Paris's most famous artists.